So if melanoma rates are increasing in recent years, wouldn't it be wise to look further back into our history? Were our ancestors affected by the sun in this way? Were they so scared and fearful of the life-giving fireball in the sky? You see, our ancestors didn't need SPF 50. They had something called melanin. Melanin is our body's natural photoprotective pigment. It absorbs UV radiation, dissipates it as heat, and protects cellular DNA. In fact, deeply pigmented skin can have an SPF equivalent of 13 plus. That's why when exposed to sun, lighter skinned individuals develop a tan, an adaptive response called faculative pigmentation. Over time, this builds up protection and reduces the risk of burns. Additionally, humans possess DNA repair enzymes like photolases and tumor suppressor proteins like P53 that actively repair UV-induced damage. Tanning induced by gradual sun exposure significantly reduced UV damage markers in keratinocytes, suggesting an active, built-in mechanism of adaptation. The key point reference is gradual, slowly building your base layer, a solar callus, if you will, so that you can avoid the burning, which is never advised. 